Hey guys, thanks for watching. We are going to cover what are PIP limits. So uh, there's two sections of PIP limits. First is $10,000. It's up to $10,000 in medical bills and or disability benefits. They define disability benefits as loss of income, uh, which we call lost wages, loss of earning capacity, all expenses to do household chores. Oh, my neck hurts. I can't wash the dishes like I used to. I need to pay somebody money to wash my dishes. It should cover that. We know that I've never, out of uh, thousands and thousands of PIP claims, I've never seen anybody actually get paid for that. Um, and then paid every two weeks is the rule, that this should be paid every two weeks. Um, if you're watching this video, if you're a doctor, if you work for a doctor's office, if you're a lawyer, you work in a law office, 99.9% .9 of the time, money goes towards medical bills, does not go towards disability benefits. And remember, it pays 80%, and I got a little Barry Bonds asterisk up here because 80% uh, of what? The total medical bills? No, we're gonna cover that in the next video. Um, so 80% of medical bills and or disability benefits. Disability, we call it lost wages pretty much, but it's more defined there. And that's 60%, 60% of loss of income, loss of earning capacity, expenses to do household chores. Um, I've, ne I've seen this paid out on like 10 or 20 claims out of thousands, um, and then never have I seen them actually pay the expenses for household chores. Big, big important issue right here is automatically $5,000 in death benefits. Somebody dies in a car accident. People overlook the PIP benefits. Why? I don't know. They get, everybody's looking at the BI limits, the UM limits, okay? Who can we go after? But they always forget that there's an automatic this is up to 10,000, so you gotta, you gotta get $10,000 in medical bills and loss of income and stuff like that to get up to 10,000. This is an automatic $5,000. You send the death certificate with a letter, who to make the check payable to, they should pay the whole 5,000, okay? It's in addition to medical benefits and disability. Disability is the loss of income that we talked about. It's in addition to, so someone gets in a really bad wreck, they go to the hospital, they're there, they die the next day. They should get their up to 10,000 in medical bills and then they should get an automatic five. So $15,000, uh, but five obviously goes to the person, uh, their family, and who's it payable to? Payable to the estate, the relatives by blood, legal adoption, marriage, or any person equitably entitled to the death benefits is what that person gets paid. Thanks for staying tuned in, thanks.